Hi angels. So today we are discussing liars. <sighs> I hate liars. And what's the need for someone to lie? My answer is there is absolutely no need for you to lie when you're in a relationship. Like, when you meet somebody, I feel like you should be 100% open with them and tell them exactly what you want and what you are expecting from them. No if, ands, or buts. And they should do the same to you. Those type of relationships make the best relationships when you can be honest with someone. Okay, so when you first meet somebody, um, if you want a committed relationship, you just want it to be you guys, and that's it. That's what you want, and that's what you tell them. Then that person tell you what they're looking for. Now, if that person is looking for the same thing, then you guys are compatible. If that person is not looking for the same thing, then you know that you should not go any further, and you should not try to change them. Because most likely that's not going to happen. It's just going to cause you so much problems down the line. Because this person wants something totally different than what you want. So just move on. Now, if when you first meet somebody and um, they don't want a committed relationship, they shouldn't lie to you. They should just tell you the truth. Okay, I don't want to commit a committed relationship. If you feel the same, you're compatible. And you should go on with that relationship. If you don't, then... And you're looking for something committed and strong, then say bye-bye to them. Move on. Find something else. Somebody else who shares the same values as you. Why waste your time on someone who isn't looking for the same thing you're looking for? You're just basically wasting your time. Okay, so if that person tells you at the beginning of the relationship that they do not believe in marriage and they don't want to be married, but you want to be married... And someday you see yourself married. What do you do? Do you carry on with this person and try to change their mind? I mean, of course you could. If you're willing to go through the ups and downs of everything that you're going to be experiencing. But if you don't want to go through all of the mess, then... You leave that person alone and you go find yourself somebody who wants to marry you someday and who believes in marriage. Because that's going to be the best relationship for you. And, um, you know, no lies, just trust and honesty. So, basically, when you are looking for your match they need to have the same valuable values as you do if you want to be committed then they should want the same thing if you want to be married one day they should want the same thing so you guys have to discuss this this is very important in your relationship and it's something really that needs to be discussed like at the beginning of your relationship. Don't wait 
years down the line to ask that person, would you like to be married one day? Then boom, they say no. After years of being with them, you're just finding out if they want to be married one day. But you do. You want marriage. And now you find yourself in a relationship years later with somebody who don't want to get married. And that's going to mess you up. Because you wasted your time on somebody who doesn't even have the same You know, who want the same thing as you do. So, that's my advice. And um, I think that's darn good advice in a relationship. And um, if you find yourself in a relationship with somebody who's lying to you. Uh, dump them in the trash where they belong. Because nobody has time for lies. Who has time for that these days? You want to be able to um, be with someone who, who's honest and who you can trust. So, if time after time you're finding out that they're lying to you, dump them in the trash. Because you don't want trash. You want the real deal. So to save yourself a lot of hurt, just discuss stuff like this in the beginning. Um, just get it out there, you know. It's no problem in discussing what you want in a relationship. Because everybody has a right to get what they want in their relationship. So... Discuss what you want in the beginning so you can make sure that it matches with what your partner wants. So you guys won't have too much problems, you know, down the road. Um, And like I said, if you do come upon your partner lying all the time, then dump them in that trash can. Move on, find somebody who's not going to lie to you and who's going to be honest and who loves you just as much as you love them. At the end of the day, I don't think nobody wants to be with a liar. Nobody wants to be with a liar. Okay, a liar, a cheater, a abuser. Who wants those things? And life is too short to deal with those type of things. If you're going to deal with stuff like that and you're going to always be unhappy, you might as well be by yourself. Okay? Because I'm pretty sure being by yourself, you can make yourself happier than being with someone who's going to lie to you time after time, cheat on you, or abuse you. So those are my tips, and I'm sticking with them. Okay, so um, I hope you enjoyed this video. And um, don't forget to give my video a thumbs up. And please don't forget to subscribe. So you can see much, much more interesting videos from yours truly. Thank you. Bye, angels.